With the Occupy movement now all but spent, the campaign has now turned to destroying the retail side of Christmas and to bring down that capitalist pig Santa Claus for being such a spendthrift. They're calling it Buy Nothing Day. This conspiracy has been hatched by Adbusters, the Vancouver-based magazine that not only inspired the Occupy movement, but now wants us to occupy Christmas and have us not spend a dime on our loved ones nor donate a single penny to Christmas charities lest the capitalists make a profit. The launch is today, which is Black Friday in the United States, the day retailers hope will bring about sales that will hopefully save their businesses. For Canada, the Grinches and Adbusters want Occupy Christmas to begin tomorrow, a month to the day from Boxing Day, the mega day for retailers on our side of the border who, depending on their sales, would either make it or break it. Lucky for me, I was able to escape from the clutches of the anonymous crowd, which, if you saw yesterday's commentary, had me taken off the air as a saboteur in a V for vendetta mask, made all sorts of threats about bringing down the world, much like the adbuster bunch is now doing. Yes, the anarchists may be on a roll, but I plan to shop till I drop, or at least until my wallet pocket gives my hand a slap. Christmas is all about the birth of Jesus, yes, but it's also a time when families truly get together to count their blessings, exchange gifts with loved ones, and help those less fortunate in the world. It is not something to screw around with. If Adbusters wants to pick on someone, pick on the bloody tooth fairy. A kid's tooth under the pillow used to be worth a loony or maybe toony. Nowadays, it's a fiver. For Sun News, I'm Mark Bonacoski, National Editorial Writer, Sun Media.